Hello and welcome back to Spirit for I have upgraded box uh, flat to full, so we don't have to worry about that. We can check it out later. But for now, let's disturb Susanna, I guess. Let's see. Mm. Well, well, you're back with your creepy looking dolls. These things are most definitely haunted, you know that, right? You even look cursed. I can see it in your eyes. Those eyes have seen things. Mm -hmm. Out of this world things. Deep in the abyss things. You should really keep this habit of collecting such strange mm -hmm. objects. Mm -hmm. It would clear your head. It would even give me some peace of mind. Like this. Mm -hmm. Just get out of my sight. And we're gonna try it on later. Wait, we're done with that. Tiny. <laughs> I know I have to fish more. I just hate it. Mm -hmm. Here we are again. Still going strong with ingots. My hands are literally tied by my profession. I have to accept the trust which you bring me. What is it now? Your pockets are f pockets full of ingots. Remember to take them out before you go swimming. Here's a little something to show you I care. Not about you, but the act of showing that I care. <laughs> uh, I don't wanna know. I think it's 100 of them. We need scalp to fish more. I think we can get that off the ship. And this, I know we have on ship. So yeah. Thank you, Susan. Ooh, that wasn't my intention. <laughs> I guess I pressed the shift, but that wasn't my intention. So let's set sail. Ooh, Furugawa. And in the meantime, I think I can say, oh, right. Mom, could it be could this one? Hard shell clam, I think that's what that was one of them. Oh, actually. Let's see, cooking is finished. I don't remember what I put here. Oh, eggs and cheese, I think. What? Nice. So let's try something else with eggs. Bacon, I think we have some bacon on next. Eggs and garlic. That sounds good. And about the thing that I saw. It's over here. No, get back here. Urchin. That's what I want. Can we look for the collection or something? No. And I keep forgetting about this one. But we will be in the right place to pick strawberries. Or in the right region, I should say. This... nope, it didn't work. Not entirely okay, vibe necklace as well. So it is worth through. Yeah. Oh, it's always worth. It's morning, we can build his lair. Oh, he's so cute. <gasps> Look how those minis! Awesome. I wish, always wish to have that room like that. <laughs> but I never had enough money to buy games or figurines or anything. Now, and now that I'm an adult, I still don't have money to get those things because they are so damn expensive. Excellent. Oh. 
and egg and bacon. What the hell is that sound? I think it was Kido that was making this sound. Anyway, do we have to visit her in the evening as well? Because if that's so, then I might as well go and look for strawberries. <laughs> we'll see. I forgot that, that how far away the shrine was. Uh, no, I don't want to sell anything. I want to buy, if anything. Yeah. Hope to have some. I have to wait. So, we, I'm actually gonna go back. I'm gonna pick some strawberries and then I'll get back here. So, go back. And we're back again. <sighs> Okay, so apparently corn and meat gives c cereal. Oh, that's disgusting. It's honestly disgusting. Ouch. Oh, well. Hopefully Lily doesn't mind that we're in the middle of the night. She'll be here still. Please be here and please stop lagging. <laughs> this photo album sure makes you look well traveled, sis. Listen up, because I'm going to read you your embarrassing postcard. Ah, well, let me find my famous Stella voice. One second. Dear Mom and Dad Lily. And Lily. My trip has been amazing so far. I'm even making friends. What a boring thing to say. At this rate, summer vacation will be gone in a flash. Last weekend I went to Shirakagawa Go in the Toriyama Prefecture. I took a tour to visit these beautiful rice paddies. It was an impressive sight. Next to these incredible houses at the bottom of the mountains, it was especially beautiful at night with the glow of the moon. Oh, Stella, you perv. He is an art curator from Germany. He is creating an art exhibition in Nagasaki. The tour was in Japanese, so he helped me with some of the nuances, gave me his address and invited me to his show. We miss you all. And I can't wait for you to visit me in a few months, Stella. Yes, yeah, stay out of my room, Lily. I didn't. Wow, you were so outgoing. I don't remember ever being like that. So full of life. I was always a bit dramatic, let's say. I wonder if you went to see Gustav's exhibition. That was his name, right? We never got to go on that trip to see you. I got sick around that time. He had trouble walking. His body was swelling and everything hurt him. I never understood why they kept it from you. They probably knew you'd come back as soon as they told you. Take care of him. I get to see that get sicker and sicker. I wasn't able to do anything to help. I still remember your face when you got home. A second, it was like you didn't recognize him. Let's keep going. It's not like you've ever shielded away, shed away from death. You basically made it to your whole world. I'm sure you've got some pictures of when you moved to Montreal. Let's take a look. Oh. No. Stay away from Astrid. I swear. Stay away from her. And stay away from Gwen. Wait. It's actually, stay away from everyone. <laughs> You're such. I guess it's. Well, I don't know if she's jealous or maybe she's. That's how she's grieving. Her older sister is sick. Maybe even dying. Well, maybe she. F oh, she might be thinking that Stella doesn't hear anything, but. As we can see, she can hear 
I will fairly well. Say rice. Oh, it was cereal and I think some sea things. Yes. So we were supposed to change. What about that? Yeah, wrong house. Wrong house again. Got them. I honestly don't remember. <sighs> Let's see. You can change your. Oh, I love this color. I really do. Violet Classic is the blue blackberry. Let's go with the Twilight. Now we look like a classic witch. I know. Actually, there's no real reason for me to keep you. Uh, since we still get before we get to that storm, so be right back. Okay, so we are nearing storm. We are basically, I think, in storm already. All we have to do right now is wait for. Oh, that doesn't look good at all. Shouldn't. Our challenge. This is an easy one. A little bit of rain and thunder. I won't say this often. Your survival probabilities are rather high. Just don't let your guard down. And won't end up like grilled chicken. Remember, use your dash ability in there. You'll need to move really fast. Heads up! Thunder is here! Yep, it would have helped if I could. I don't think we'll need. <laughs> More than dash. I need less. Less ladders in here. Really, dash actually doesn't help. Thank you, kitty. Okay, and we're done. More blends. Than we usually do this time. <laughs> and time. Not bad. I wouldn't put it on a leaderboard or you on a podium, but you've got some talent. This should be a good reward for you. I don't have anything else. Scram. Ooh, thank you. Thank you, lady. Miss. Whatever you want, <laughs> you want me to call you. Shellfish too. Okay, so let's go over here into the shadow forest. And yeah, I was still thinking that. I for I totally forgot about that. I could have been done. Thirty-four sixty-nine. Nice. Actually. Oh, okay. Oh, it's all the way up here. Yeah, we're definitely visiting this forest first. And of course I lost it and again. I'm gonna scratch the previous one and it was 34 and 69. Okay, there's that. And we might as well say goodbye to Gustav and I I really don't want to do that. 
open. Yes, I really did grow fond of them. Just it won't be the same without them. Okay, we have to get up there somehow. Down. Okay, I got it. First things first, that's it. Let's take care of that. And some odd seeds. Sorry, in the middle. As expected, we go to here. Is that some? No, I think we have this kind of tree. Okay, I'm not entirely sure so who we'll did it. Just in case. Fine. Yeah, we have it. What's that? Wait, what? Okay, that's uh, peculiar. There's nothing to the other side as well. So let's see whether I can swim. No! Oh. Okay, so there will be something else in here. Interesting though, very interesting. does it look right now? Okay, there's nothing more to that. So you can go like this, like this, and this. I really don't want to do that. But you know, Gustav is always sitting in his... Uh, of course you're hungry because you never get out! Find any? Thank you, Skipper. This meal is nourishing. Um, Gustav. Um, are you always here? Uh, <gasps> Thank you. Really. You're too much. Ghost. <laughs> oh, they are too good. Really. They are always so nice to us. Uh -huh. Alright, oh, I hide you recently. Hmm. Well, I did feed you and it didn't seem to affect your mood. Interesting. Maybe I have some breakfast for you? No, no, no. Can breakfast. Breakfast! Awesome! You like the same as before. Oh, that's great. I found this in my room. I thought you might need it. You really are so cute. I need food. Yes, madam. Let's buy you. Thank you for the meal. I'm not gonna hug you. I have one memory I particularly cherish. It was one day after a particularly rowdy gym class. They came back to my room, famine with hormones and desperation. When my first years on the job, shaping in the minds of the youth, they told me. Anyway, I couldn't control any of them. They wouldn't keep still for a second. I wasn't shaping anything that day. I snapped. I started screaming. It was the only thing those monsters could understand. I told them truths that would only reveal themselves later in their lives. When you lose a parent. When you lose your best friend. When you lose your job. 
when you start to really crumble from the inside. After an episode like that, I should have learned a lesson. I didn't. I vowed to focus on talent and excellence. I vowed to never let go again and steal my resolve. Oh, no and... He didn't fake it. Yeah, it was really well hidden and I see. Oh, there's something in the background. No, wait! Stop the ship! Stop the ship! As I said, stop the ship! <laughs> or turn the ship now. I wanna go see the place. It seems intriguing. And we and I think we still we're still missing one spirit. Just see one home we can build. I hope the place we're gonna get it. Wait. No, I really hope it will be some kind of a secret. Get up, get us on the water or something. Oh, I was sure I saw something. Oh well. Never mind, I guess. We visited some new place. Yeah. Now we can go straight up, straight to the ever to the ever door. We will be alone, just the two of us. No, sorry, I forgot about you. <laughs> Hello, Commander. As a hero. Uh, should have read the script sooner. Oh well, never mind. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm picking up walls, and you should too. It's always a good moment f when we're in between games to browse through your character sheet. Maybe think of what you'll do next with your XP. But don't worry, I'll soon be ready. Uh, what did you think of the me of the beginning of Golf Nemo's story arc? Pretty cool, eh? I've taken as a basis the Dungeon of Destruction, sprinkled here and there a few bits from the masks of Ag Imhotep. Uh -huh. And added a single best magic item from the royal campaign. And and I'll let you in on a little secret. Remember one I omgrove omgrove hawk from the free towers? Yeah, remember him? I added him to the campaign! Converting his task to the new edition was a pain in the butt, though. But I'm so excited! Wait, wait, I'll go back to my notes. And be ready soon enough. See ya! Oh, can I hug you? Oh. oh, you're hungry. I'm gonna feed you something. Do you like sweet tea? Humble thanks. Oh, you know. Commander, your humble servant needs to. Uh, uh, oops. Yeah, sorry, but it's fun, you know. I love being your humble servant and telling stories and crafting monsters and having attention on the screen. What I don't like though is that I'm I'm the only one buying all the books and usually preparing everything. But both Ryan and Jerome are cool enough. I mean, yeah, they could sh for sure make an effort. Ryan is still low. That being said, sorry. That being said, I always have to remind him of the rules of fourth flanking. Well, me or Jerome, anyways. That guy, polar opposite, doesn't give a single frack about role playing. He only wants to roll dice and finds loopholes in the rules. And it pisses me off. But hey, at least Bob usually backs me up. Well, maybe Bob is in character a bit too much. Okay, who am I to judge? I got you ready, take me away. Very well, onwards. Yes, I am ready in... nope.
It seems to me you were quite surprised by my request to leave. And it seems to me you still are. But you have to understand, Stella. Everything is but a meaningless arrangement of items. Everything you've ever known, seen or experienced. Or choose circumstances. In the universal chaos, humanity emerged. The tiny bit more purposeful than the rest. Out of an incredible faculty. That of creating meaning, however fleeting it might be. I have no inherent meaning. Neither do you. But we can create, organize, put in order, and thus create purpose and meaning. Transcendent the primordial chaos. All of humankind does so. We create machines that are useful to take control. Machines like a chair, like the chair, the one that subsumed me. But maybe also that made me truly realize what impermanence, impermanence means. For our numerous creations only have meaning as long as they are useful. And when finally they are unneeded, once again do they turn to heaps of metal and wood and bones, melted back into the universal chaos, stripped in their inherent humanity. And all our, ba all our, all our bodies and all our minds in a similar fashion. I do not yet know what to do about this. Usefulness is an easy way to meaningfulness, but not a trustworthy one. It vanishes as quickly as we do, and so it seems the only hope humanity has for transcendence is through art. Meaningfulness pulled from our chaotic minds, not for utility, but for its own sake. And after the artist has been long gone, turned to dust, the art remains. And even after the last one of all humans, we still return to the primordial chaos. Provided that we have protected it, art will remain. Uh -huh. And so it is that art alone is left in our wake. The only veritable form of transcendence to ever have been in our grasp. Proof of our existence and of our pitiful efforts to raise them from the chaos. As with some unknown script from long gone power. Oh, we're here. Well, well, now, Stella, as Mandias beckons, let's go. Hmm. And that is gonna be it for today. For now, thank you very much for your life and see you soon. Bye!